I let myself go to feel the blisters of my heart, till the danger of becoming a better man conquered me. The rest of me rests in the reset of the complexity of a possibility that I may just be somebody, to someone, that never knew me, but wanted to take a chance. I would dance in glee if I could see a light that my shadows didn't drive off. I want to be grabbed and held outside of the chaos, and not be a mistake that created it. Molding conversation together, seeing that things are progressing, she keeps pressing her head against me, silent to the quake of hearts that ache and yells the stories to tell. Maybe she needs me as much as I need her, but I doubt it. I shout it and loud about mine till the noise is declined with a kiss. Just one wish and I got it delivered to me so that I could now dream again. Jeremiah is now a son to me, and I have altered my perception to consider him a blessing. All he wants is love like his father. All those nights I denied him, made him cry to imaginary friends and fairies, neglecting the very thing I needed to give him, being conceited and really betraying him, as Monet did me years ago. So now it is time to grow. My hands hold them both as they hang from my arms, falling asleep. Limbs with treasures I had to sacrifice, the sacrifice of um, the life I was going to delete. Exit out with these clown tears, and now I'm proud here with you. Sun rays increased the yawns, and dawn greeted by a new day. She stayed with me, too tired to go, and comforted, comfortable in my prayers. I think the angels tell her my secrets and she knows the deepest feelings are still forbidden. She is hidden that concern for now and breakfast is something that goes down. Jeremiah is so happy she is around it's like she improved us. Dishes washed up and tub play for Jeremiah splashing around. Brian was right. Jeremiah needs me and these regrets sharp like, like knife sets. I haven't talked to Brian. My mother, my sister, still haven't heard from my daughter. I need to reclaim what it is that I lost along the way. Pursue the things I value with faith in the crown. I know in his name I can change this and rearrange this to where my sorrow can become a benefit with work and time. So much I have wasted getting Jeremiah out and now on to baking. The boy sure loves cookies. She makes them some every other Sunday before she goes to work later in the evening. He jumps in joy and sings a song as I can as I join in along. Play with the little pirate sailing away on the couch surrounded by sharks, toss him on a pillow and he battles back it to me to his father, determined not to let me be alone. I once had a situation with a gutter bitch and now I have just him gold standard of laughter that matters to me after coming out of my disasters chocolate chip cookies and milk and just the feeling of having a family i never had one of those before i didn't run from quite honest i honestly never truly opened up to my family i stayed complicated but this isn't the same because it feels right right for me for us jeremiah is asleep and the cookies are put on a plate on the counter Apron on the handle of a drawer, with my hands on her handles and more. I have to put Jeremiah in his bed. Poor fellow, exhausted by her adventures. Walking out, I see her once cute face, smug with the pout, still in the kitchen, wanting attention. Reunited, lips ignited, delighted, I could co-pilot off the wings of an angel. Tangled in each other, no other matters. I don't matter. We soar to my room and land on the sheets with nails in me. My back scratched with passion as the snack, just feeding off of her intensity. Buttons pressed and shirts and pants released and things slid off. Bodies, one with the cloth. Soft skin, I can't restrain anymore. When desire became more than passion, then I have found it. Equilibrium, my heart has dropped. I am art, poetry, love. Light skin tones and sweet moans pierce the clouded grounds of heaven. God, I found you. I found your happiness. Your smile you gave me when shit wasn't working out that helped push on. I found a reason to walk. 
a reason to not shut up anymore in the chaos that overtook my soul and talk. I found you hidden in me with every step of the way. God, I have found a reason to smile again. I'm glad I got lost in you. Lost in redemption. Lost in glory. Lost in the care to share myself with someone that you gave me. Gave me the love when I thought I couldn't anymore. Wouldn't anymore. I haven't made love to anyone on this level. Trembling kisses and tears, we catch off each other's face, busy with the taste of commitment. My soul is hers to redeem from you, God. Squeezing her and then releasing her from this trance we entertain until we came. Holding her till she dozes off with light kisses on her head until I'm dead. I will not leave her. I will not leave her. I will not leave her. <sighs> beep, beep, beep. Slight crack opens as she, she uh, uh, slight crack open to see her up and out leaving. Snooze. Knock, knock, knock. Daddy, daddy. Roll over then trying to come to. Daddy, daddy. I want, can I have some of a cookie? Huh? Jeremiah, that you? Yes, Daddy. Can you get me cookie? You have. You can have three cookies. Get your little stool, and go get them from the counter. Can you do that? Yes, Daddy. Thank you, Daddy. Off in the dust he goes as I look at the clothes on the floor. My God, I think she gave me all of herself. Let me put these clothes up. Some on. Sit here while I. Jeremiah's in the kitchen with his stool, pulling and tugging at the apron in the way. So through the hole, he places, he places his hand and head through, reaching for cookies till one is grabbed and then tasted, reaching again for the other two on tiptoes. Slip off the stool, and head gets tangled up in the apron as he goes around and swings his body. Cookies in the mouth and can't swallow or shout. With feet out and unable to regain balance from the tilt and slip, hanging and crying his very last tear. Thump. I, so at war with reality, want Nick to still dream. I guess the boy dropped something, so let me wake up. Wake up. Wake up. Finally, look at the ceiling, sitting up. Get up! Get up! Feet to the floor and the opening of the door. Jeremiah, you sleep, buddy? Where are you at? Playing hide and go seek? Hmm. No answer. Let me walk down the hall. Lights in the kitchen, but then where's my boy? God, no. God, no. God. Wake up. Wake up. Unwrapping the apron from around his little neck. Shakes over the floor full of tears. Get up. Jeremiah. Get up. Daddy's here. Stop playing. Daddy needs you to get up. Lifting him up, taking him to the couch to lay on. Fucking ring around his neck and eyes not responsive. God. Why? Get him up, please, God. I need him. Cheer up, cheer up, I wake up. Anger sets in. He beats on Jeremiah's chest to get him to wake up. Shakes him. No pulse. I failed you. I failed you. What have I done? What have you done? God, son of a... Every... Every, every time. Something bad happens to me. Can I have a... Just... One moment? 
just one day where I can be happy. You've taken my daughter. Fucking four years I haven't seen her. And you care about that? Give me back my son. God, please give me back my son. What am I to love now? Yeah, I hate myself. I hate you. I hate you. You you made me. You you made me do this. To live this. To have a black heart. 